Hi, it's Ashida Andre with the Red Carpet Report, and I'm here at the NAACP Awards Luncheon. Thank you so much for having this with us today. How are you doing? I am doing well. Just extraordinary. So take us through, how are you feeling now with the Oscars, you know, not really giving us the recognition that we deserve? How are you feeling about that? Um, I'll simply say it's perplexing, but as perplexed as I am about that, I'm excited about the Image Awards. When you think about the fact, uh, on the 50th anniversary of the Selma to Montgomery March, the 50th anniversary of the Voting Rights Act, we just celebrated Martin Luther King's birthday here in this room. The constellation of talent and artistry and, and musicality in the Image Wars is really a window on America. Everything that's great about the country is represented here. And so that's what we celebrate. We're not going to be... Um, Denied anything, right? That's right. Yeah. So I had a, a conversation with Chris Spencer, and he basically said, you know what, forget them. Forget what they're doing. We have our own. We have the Image Awards. We have this. We're here. We're celebrating. Not to worry about it as, as you know, as actors, as singers, and just don't worry about them. Worry about what we're doing. Would you agree with that? I, I absolutely would be. I would agree with that. I'll simply say this: there are moments in life when the talent of our people, and I mean that broadly, all of our people, all communities of color. It's so resplendent, so powerful, so compelling, it cannot be denied. And I would simply say, take a look at what we represent, it can't be denied. Absolutely. Absolutely. Thank you so much. That was very encouraging for not just everyone here on the red carpet, but for us as well, interviewing you guys, because we look up to you so much. Thank you so much. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. Good to meet you. Good to meet you. Thank Thanks you. for watching. Like, subscribe, and leave me a comment. And be sure to watch the NAACP Image Awards February 6th on TV One.